In a recent episode of the podcast Fantastic Geeks, Brizzy and Tessa questioned how many rats it would have taken to feed Salazar Slytherin's basilisk for a thousand years, and this is the type of question this channel exists to answer. Firstly, how many rats does a normal snake eat? This varies between different types and sizes of snake, but as a guide we'll use an adult ball python, which are around 5 feet long, weigh around 2 kilos, and eat one rat roughly every 50 days. Adult basilisks grow to around 50 feet long, so using the square cube law we get that a basilisk is about a thousand times bigger than a ball python. Scaling the rate of food up to this size would mean a basilisk would need around 7,300 rats a year, or 7.3 million rats over 1,000 years. Where would all these rats come from? Well, the UK has an estimated 10.5 million rats. Using the estimated rat population density, Hogwarts would only have around 8 rats living inside the castle. So how did the basilisk survive? Well, most of the thousand years, the basilisk was effectively put in suspended animation. Or as Tessa put it, I don't know, magic? 